Ferrari. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Arnold Schwarzenegger with the drivers. Oh. Hey man. Congratulations. How you Congratulations. Arnold Schwarzenegger, man. How you doing? Well, it's wonderful to be here in Melbourne, wow. to be in Australia. And I was just asked to conduct the interviews with the winners here. And let me tell you something I'm so excited about because just for the last two days I was interviewing the most fittest people, the strongest people, the, 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 the most energetic people in the, at the Arnold's Classic and now I'm interviewing the, the fastest people in the world. So Luis, what does it feel like having won last year's world championship and now winning the first race again? <laughs> well, it's obviously a real pleasure to be here. We have the greatest fans here today. Thank you so much for coming out. Um, you know, my team did my team did an amazing job today, and, and, and it's an incredible feeling, obviously, to, to current, continue on from last year. But also to be up here with you, man. I thought you were taller. I thought well, I was taller on the Terminator. I'm not wearing my high heels. <laughs> <laughs> but so, what does it feel like? And then let me just ask you: How much physical training do you have to do to be in that kind of a shape and to go through a race like that? We all train very hard, and it's and people don't actually realize that we are athletes. We have to train a lot. It's, it's, it's incredibly physical in those cars. So um, you know, it's it's just uh, I'm I'm very honored to be up here um, amongst these great drivers and also with this team doing such an amazing job. So. Well, thank you very much. Congratulations. Congratulations. Now, just a question uh, also to you. What does it feel like being second? And do you think that you're going to make up and maybe beat this man this year? Well, uh, I mean, it's, it's a nice feeling to be second today because it's an awesome start uh, into the season for us as a team. Uh, absolutely stunning car they've given us. I mean, unbelievable. And uh, no, Lewis has just done a fantastic job this weekend. He drove, uh, drove like a world champion all weekend. So couldn't quite beat him, uh, but for sure I was trying every single lap all the way to the maximum and, and I will do all year. I'll give him a big run for his money uh, and hopefully beat him. And uh, yeah, also thank you very much to the organizers. Really, you've done an amazing job this weekend. I'm sure you all agree. Uh, it's been a fantastic weekend for everybody and also all of you. You've been great and uh, put on a great atmosphere. Thank you. How much does concentration have to do with it to win this competition, to win this race? Yeah, a lot of it is in the, in the head, of course. Uh, not only during one race, but during the whole season to keep your energy, to focus, uh, but also especially during one race, it is very demanding uh, in the head, you know, to not make a single mistake whilst being physically, you know, uh, it's challenging physically too. So uh, it's, it's tough. Well, you've done a great job. Congratulations. And uh, I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next race. Okay. Thank you. Now let's Hey. Now do I come up or you coming come up down? Here, coming up here. We have enough room. Yes. Uh, what does it feel like being now with Ferrari? Ah, it feels great. It feels absolutely... Uh, it's a very, very big honor. And uh, I'm very happy. Obviously, it's a great start to the season for us. Uh, we had a very good winter already. Um, the team has worked phenomenally hard. And uh, we can be very proud. I said to the guys, uh, thank you very much. Grazie mille. Noi abbiamo una macchina bella per la qualifica ma anche per, 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 il, per la gara so we have a great race not only in qualifying but also for the race and it's, uh, it's great to join them and I'm really proud there's a lot of work ahead of us trying to beat these two and beat Mercedes but uh, I'm sure we will how much preparation goes in every day to prepare for a race like this nah, it's, it's our job in the end it's uh, you know it's not just uh, yeah, turning up at the weekends and doing the job, but all, all week, as Louis said, you have to be fit, so we have to train, we have to look after each other here and there. I think I can spare pizza, especially this year, but uh, yeah, for sure, it's a full-time job. Well, thank you very much. Congratulations. And I know I will be watching you in the next race, okay? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I know that you are going to say now, when it comes to the next race, I'll, I'll be, be back. back, right? Okay. So, so let's say it together. I'll, I'll be, be back. back. All right. Give him a big hand, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wow. That has set the benchmark pretty high, I would say, for podium interviews this year. Yes, your eyes were not deceiving you. That was Arnold Schwarzenegger.